hello guys welcome back to another basic java programming tutorial now we are going to learn about what is the this keyword what is the use of this keyword in java so the, this is a pointer used to, to represent the current class object in some situation we need to refer the current class object so you can understand the use of this keyword with an example so here in this class there is a class called the box uh, that contain two constructor on the second constructor we have some arguments we have three arguments double l h and d and we initialize some variables here so here we have some class variables called uh, length height and depth and we initialize the three variables using this parameterized constructor so here i am going to make some change so here the formal parameters are capital L, capital H and capital D. Now here I am going to change this one into small L A N G T H small length. Now here there is a problem. Here our local variable name sorry the class variable name is length L E N G T H and here the formal variables for formal variable identifier is also same. So of course here we got a problem because the formal variable name and the instance variable name are same. So if you using the variable name length inside this constructor or any method that will represent the local variable. So for this constructor the formal argument length is local. So if you represent, if you use the identifier length inside this constructor, that will always represent the local variable. It will not represent the instance variable. That means a local variable will hide the instance variable. So what to do to access the instance variable? So in this case, to access the instance variable, we have to refer the object used to invoke the method. So here in this case this is a constructor so we have to get the object that will invoke this constructor so here I use this so in this case this will represent the current class object that will invoke this constructor so this dot length means it will represent the instance variable so if you simply using length that will represent the local variable that means the formal argument so for initializing this instance variable you have to use the this pointer so this dot length will represent the instance variable of this class so this dot length equal to length so now this is correct gth now this is correct because the left side will represent the instance variable and the right side will represent the local variable so this is one of the important use of this pointer in java programming so this is one of the professional programming approach if you have some formal arguments you have to use the same name same identifier name for the formal arguments and the variable that is a good programming practice so instead of h here i am going to use the same variable name height h e i g h t height so for representing the instance variable i have to use this pointer this dot height equal to height So now the right right side height will represent the formal argument and instead of capital D here I am going to use depth okay so that is the use of the this keyword in Java so if you using the this keyword that will represent the current class object so I, I hope you understand what is the exact use of the this keyword in java thank you for watching see you in the next episode